What's up everyone, Chris at Dentless Touch back again with another paintless dent repair video. Wait a minute, let me stop saying that. Let's back up. What's up everyone, Chris at Dentless Touch back again with Inside the Dent Vlogs. Episode three, thanks for joining me yet again. If you're new to this channel, we fix dents and we bring you along on that journey of how we do it. Also, we give tips and tricks uh, to technicians and all of that good stuff. So today's vehicle is a 2012 Chevy Equinox. We have quite a few appointments today, um, but that is the first car. So let's get started. See, it made that that little we call it like poke marks and i definitely didn't want to do that but it didn't do any damage but it's because that the cap split i don't know if you can see it but right there it's split so it's now metal to metal so i'm going to knock that down so i don't stress it even even further so let me switch caps resetting the dent.
but there's something holding on. Let me talk to you guys for a second. I know YouTube is a great platform, especially for the DIY guys. Um, I actually call it YouTube University. I've learned a lot uh, over YouTube um, from tutorials and all that good stuff. But what you see is basically 15 years of experience. That's why I'm able to get these dents out so clean and so fast. Um, I won't say I do not recommend you to try it out, but it is a very, we make it look so easy. And so I do not want to be liable for any damage that you do to your vehicle. 99% uh, of the time, if a customer attempted to do the repair, they did, obviously they did more damage than the initial dent. Uh, but it also can crack paint and do some things that is basically out of our hands and, and you would need to go to a body shop in order to get those repaired. So shameless plug, if you're interested in getting into this industry, we have a two day course. Link will be in the description below. There's also a ton of online um, tutorials and, and, and uh, training platforms out there. I'll leave a few in the, the description below. But I just wanna warn you guys, as you see me work these dents out and how for me it's easy or second nature, these are this is years and years and years of uh, practice and muscle memory and all that good stuff. I've trained my eyes to see every single detail, the entire gradient spectrum. Um, so that, that's why I'm so able to get these dents up the way I am. So just a fair warning, guys. That's all I had to tell you. Keep watching. There's more to this day. Let's go. All right, so that's it at the shop. That customer was just here for an estimate. A lot of damage. I could not give him a price based off of pictures. And, uh, you know, I recommend it to come on in. Let's put it under some light and see what the true damage is. He said a deer hit the vehicle. And so there could be just damage all around that side of that vehicle. So, and like it was. So um, that that's it on that one. It was just an estimate. We're on our way to a body shop. And then we have a hail car to do today. And hopefully we can finish everything today. Let's see. This is a hell car also. I thought it was like a wheel, which is basically maybe a, some damage that the body shop uh, caused that they owe the customer. So they're typically small one inch dents, um, but it's a full hell car. I mean, he's not expecting me to, you know, work on the car today, but now I'm trying to figure out how to fit it in my schedule. So, but first things first, let's get an estimate. Um, so grabbing the PDR light so I can write a thorough estimate and uh, see what it comes up with. And the way body shops work is they get pressed out from insurance companies um, to get the job done as fast as they possibly can. So right now, as my, my schedule is working out right now where I have to go to basically drive an hour to go work on another hail car. 
Uh, so what I did was I called like an audible, had one of the guys uh, up north in Rockville come down, take care of that car for me. I don't know if he'll be done uh, today, um, but then that way I can start on this this car, help out the body shop by getting this one or two day uh, turnaround time for them. Uh, I'm very efficient when I work hail, so I, I'm pretty sure I can get this car done in, in four to five hours, but um, we'll see. Uh, there's not a lot of damage on the car. Um, pretty much every panel has maybe 15 hits on the uh, uh, on the top surfaces and then roughly maybe two or three on the side panel so very light car for PDR but um, we're gonna see across the shop okay because um, that tech left for the day and there's an open spot next to it that Perfect. way you're not blocking the middle lane oh yeah that's fine that's yeah. fine thank you so yeah sometimes pulling these audibles work out sometimes they don't um, we try our best efforts to make everybody happy from the insurance companies to the body shops and our own tech you know our own technicians so they can have uh, they can be home you know to go see their family they don't work until 9 10 o'clock at night uh, because there's always something to do there's always an emergency somewhere um, so we just have to delegate or just decide what actually needs to get done or what makes more sense and so for me driving an hour and then driving an hour home where this location is a little bit closer it's a higher probability that i'll have this car done i'll be home by like five and if the other tech needs help i can always go to him and help him through the evening um, because that body shop allows us to stay after hours so it's just all types of variables that come into play and we just have to dissect it and, and, and make the best decisions. So, looks like we're working on a hail car today. We were, we, you know, just not at this location, but either way, two techs are busy. Let's get it going. Kind of a side note, I just want to share with you this great podcast here. Kind of a side note, just want to share with you this great podcast here. It's called Not Overthinking. I followed a guy on YouTube. Uh, Ali, but uh, as I'm working, this is what I'm gonna be listening to. This one right here, boom. There you go. My name is Ali. I'm the doctor. I'll leave a link below. All right, guys, that's it. We just got finished doing two hail cars um, in two different locations. So kudos to the guys for taking care of that and, and helping me out and calling that audible and getting everything done. Um, so that's it. If you guys haven't already, go ahead and like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next vlog. Peace.